Deputy remains in critical condition after being hit by a car while directing traffic. Deputy Andy Lajara was struck last night outside Lakanto High School where a graduation ceremony was being held. The crash happened just as bad weather was rolling in. As Fox 13's Evan Axelbank reports, Deputy Lajara was well regarded by, is well regarded by the community. Amanda Shack has the pictures to prove her family loves Deputy Andy Lahara. My husband was just talking to him while waiting in line to leave the graduation that night. Um, and the last thing he told them, you know, be safe. As Deputy Lahara was directing traffic on Lakanto Highway after the high school graduation, a driver headed south plowed into him despite his emergency lights and reflective vest. And as soon as we started seeing the post on Facebook, my husband just had a gut feeling. The sheriff says the deputy was flung many feet and has many broken bones and internal injuries. Andy LaHara is a big teddy bear, loved by all, respected by all of those kids that he's touched the lives of. As far as what led this driver to plow into that deputy, FHP says that part of the investigation is still ongoing. The sheriff, though, says he has his own suspicions. Overwhelmingly, we know that you're many more times likely to have an accident than a drunk driver is if you're a distracted driver operating the vehicle. The sheriff says there was no sign of any braking and that the deputy's reflective vest and emergency lights should have been easily visible. The consequence now, he says, is that Deputy Lahara is facing a long road to recovery, including many surgeries. He has not yet regained consciousness, but family is at his bedside. You start to question why. Why does such a good person have to go through this? Um, the family, why, why it's such a tragedy? It's unclear as to when or if Deputy Lahara, who was a school resource officer, will be back at school making kids smile again. Evan Axelbank, Fox 13 News. And deputies say the driver has been cooperative and her vehicle is being examined to determine whether speed was a factor, among other things.